What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, Boogie2988 coming at you live once again through the power of the internet. And I'm out at the dog park with little Sammy. And I just thought I would bring you guys with me today so you guys can see what a beautiful park this is. I kind of regret not remembering my tripod, but I don't think I'll be done showing you guys parks until we've gone to every park. I just like to have the excuse to, to be out in the world and to film and I hope you bear with me. I know these videos can be a little boring, but they hopefully they can be relaxing because they're very relaxing for me. Here near the Iams Dog Park in Fayetteville is this nice little deck they built on this, well, I, <laughs> uh, lake, river. How many likes would I need to get before I would jump? into that. I don't even think you could even jump into it. I think you'd have to wade into it. Um, yeah, uh, 1 million likes on this video and I will go swimming in this. But that would probably be illegal. I'd have to check to see if it was legal first. I don't even know how that's possible. But someone, someone forgot their glasses here. What? One of the neighbors has been getting their roof redone, which makes a lot of noise. And that's made Sammy really shaky and nervous about taking walks near home. So I decided to take him here instead. <laughs> Do you see how happy he is? He loves going to the park, man. Happy dog. Over in that direction is the swing that I swing on in the TikTok video. First time swinging in a long time. But that's not where we're going. We're going to the dog park over here. Sammy doesn't like other dogs, but he'll observe them. And I like to socialize them. Of course, right now, He's more interested in that plant. You ever wonder what it is about dogs and just they find a smell they like and they gotta pee on it. And just, I don't know, man, dogs are weird. I wish I could be as happy about literally anything as he is about everything. I love little canopies like this. Just when you're walking through nature, through the trees. I have walked this path at night and it is not lit at all which is weird because this dog park's open well past dark especially in the fall and winter um a little a little scary uh i won't lie but during the day it's really nice people as always have been very judgmental about sammy not walking on a leash uh, but as i said in previous videos i wanted to go ahead and say it again here he really doesn't like wearing a collar and when you put a leash on him he gets bitey and fighty and it just ruins the good time for him. And I don't have it in me to train him to walk on a leash. That's why we do this dog park. Because no one's ever gotten in trouble for being at this dog park without their dog on a leash. So this is the park we favor the most because of that. And he sure is happy I made that decision. Still, six years of this. Never been an incident. Hopefully there never will be. Look at that sun. Look at those god rays coming through the leaves. That's not even why I pulled the camera out. Pulled it out to show you this. People have been critical of me saying, I've never seen you pick up dog poop. Well, I'm not going to film that. But I always have at least a doggy bag on me. But here's the thing. Even if I forgot one, um, every park in this area, every park has these. Really blessed to live in an area that allows us to have these for free. And trash can to put them in. So I hadn't walked very much uh, recently because I've been sick, uh, but now I'm getting back to it, especially because I'm going to Houston, Texas next week. For those of you near Houston, Texas, know that I will be down in Pasadena, Texas on July 23rd and 24th for Retropalooza. I'll link that down below. July 24th is my birthday, so you can come to Retropalooza, shake my hand, um, get an autograph, Get me to sign something, and I'll do all of that on my birthday. And my birthday gift from you to me will just be getting to see your smiling face and giving me a chance to say thank you for years of watching my videos. I'd love to see you, so let me know. Here's the little fenced-in area for people to let their dogs off the leash. There's a section for small dogs and a section for big dogs. Normally, there's never anybody in the small dog section, but there is today, so maybe Sammy will interact. I don't think he will, but hopefully he will today. What do you say? You feel like meeting other puppies today? Huh? Are you gonna be social? Are you gonna be like your daddy and never be social? Let's go see. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. What do you say? You're gonna be a wimp? They got a cute puppy over there. Do you wanna meet them? You wanna meet their puppy? 
We'll wait till puppy comes up to you. Oh, you nervous? That's okay. It's okay. What about him? You gonna make friends? <laughs> no. Nope. Not interested. Nope. You wimp. You're such a wimp. You're gonna go. You wanna go play with other puppies or no? Oh. Yeah, those guys are being aggressive, huh? Oh. All right. Maybe the small dog pen. Let's give it a shot, okay? Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Do you try to smell your butt? You hate that, huh? They look friendly enough. Don't you want to make friends? They're cute. Nope. You just want to pee on stuff, huh? That's okay. I'm pretty nice. It's crazy how much like your daddy you are. Huh? Because they definitely want to get to know you. And you ain't going to let them, huh? That's okay. That's okay. Some of us are introverts. He's not, though. Look. <laughs> nope. Nope. Daddy will protect you. Don't worry. You'll be okay. Oh. <laughs> I love you. You're a dummy, though. This is always so interesting about this dog, because he's very much like me. He wants to be around other people. He wants to look at other people. But he seems afraid to, like, interact with them. I'm the same way, man. I, somebody says hi to me, which is the equivalent, the doggy equivalent, trying to sniff my butt. I just, I don't know, man. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. I just shy away. But it's a beautiful day. I'm glad to spend in the dog park with him. And look at this dog-friendly town. This dog-friendly park, all these people out. I don't know, the internet and the news says that we may not be able to do stuff like this without a mask for very soon, and maybe even not be able to do this again for a while at all. So, if you're watching this, I'm trying to take advantage of it for Sammy's sake as well as my own. You know, while he still can. I hope it doesn't come to that. Ugh, Delta variant BS. You don't see this at every dog park, or even very every park but i love that they have a doggy water fountain <laughs> that's very cool uh-oh just telling that young lady in there um when her dog approached us six years of trying to get him to socialize with other dogs but he's loves other people afraid of other dogs the opposite of me because i love uh, i love dogs afraid of people you're not going to socialize huh you wimp just like his dad. Again, I do love sharing these parks with you. I'm so blessed to have a town just with so many parks. Look at that tree. Like, do you ever just go out and look at a tree? They're amazing. That tree is amazing. How long has that tree been here? Longer than I've been here for sure. I mean, we just got here like an hour ago, but whatever. You know what I mean? That tree's older than most of the people watching this video. Probably older than me. And Sammy went and peed on it. I find myself, even during this just extreme summer weather, hopefully even down in Texas when I get down there next week, I find myself able to do this more and more often. So still legs and back hurt, but it is what it is. And I enjoy doing it. And you guys give me a reason to keep coming back out here and doing it. So hopefully we'll do some more while we're down in Texas. I'll be filming while I'm down there. I'll film March Rulies. I'll film my birthday. I'll film hopefully some museums and some other stuff while I'm down there. As long as you keep watching, I'll still be here. Guys, thanks for watching. We love you very much, me and Sammy, and we will speak with you again soon. You ready? You think you wanna go home? You have enough socialization for today? All none of it? <laughs> yep, I, I know how you feel, bud, I get it. I know these are a natural phenomenon, like caterpillars or something, right? I don't know, but here's what I do know. They freak me out. Forget zombies, that's the apocalypse I'm afraid of. Good God.